Hey guys, welcome back to Yozar Gaming. I'm doing another gameplay video. You guys know the drill. Uh, remember, 1200 subs, the giveaway goes live, rules in the Discord, links in the description. Not sure what character I'm going to do today. It's kind of a, you know, random pick. Didn't get requested one this week, so might, might roll with Viking. Not sure yet. But we'll see. You know, you guys know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe down below. Greatly appreciate it. Now I'm going to go ahead and skip through this so you guys aren't here waiting forever. Because the map's getting big now, so it's taking a while to start loading. Alright, see you guys in a few. Alright, guys. Let's see. You know, let's roll with Battle Cruiser. I'm feeling in a very Battle Cruiser mood today. God, what's with the lag this morning? Alright, so on Battle Cruiser, he's a wonky hero. I'm going to tell you that right now. So for him, on page 2, don't even bother upgrading anything on that. Because once you get your 1k buffs, you won't do damage to the mobs. With your, like, your Remoto and stuff like that just because it's kind of broken right now it hits over the 500k mark so I'm just like I said saying that right now don't don't upgrade page 2 let's see I will start with I'm going to start with sight range just because I like having sight Then, you know, usually for most people, I'd probably recommend damage, but like I said, for me, I'm going to go with sight range. So now on Battle Cruiser, you got technical jump, and it lets you go anywhere on the map. And it takes six seconds right now, but with your, I think your. A hero buff one it makes it instant so it's not too bad it's a good you know get out of jail free card if you want to think of it that way to where oh i'm getting ready to be surrounded let's get out of here because you don't need vision like the mothership um your motto it's your big boom gun most players if you're new and you don't have stat points you won't be able to use it right at the start you'll have to at least get ability cooldowns but you'll get there Plasma charge is a stacking charge, kind of works as like Kerrigan does and whatnot. And see how he was about to kill me and then I just jumped. Get out of there. Overdrive makes it where you double the amount of attacks you do. So my standard one's 8 right now, so it would make it go 16, which ain't bad. And then that's the Yamato not bad but I haven't upgraded hardly anything yet so it doesn't do much and then this one right here streamline so it takes if you use overdrive and then you use that you're shooting the target 16 times one target versus 16 targets it's nice against bosses because you'll just sit there and pretty much shoot 16 times so you figure you take your damage times it by 16 And laser warp just slows targets down as you hit them. It's pretty nice to kite bosses with. But I'd go ahead and just max out damage and then just kind of start picking random stuff. Streamline and overdrive duration is what I'd go with next. Those would be your two most beneficial ones. Go ahead and hop down here and get hero buff two. get up here what's nice about battle cruiser you can run and gun so you can move and shoot at the same time where is the boss man oh, found him
but you can see his HP just drop. That's from my Yamato cannon. Go down here and get hero buff two. But yeah, see, makes it where it's only a one second jump versus six. It makes everything else last longer and more regen. So that takes 250 energy right now. So with that, it drops down to 200. Like I said, that will make it to where pretty much anybody can use it. And whatnot. So it's not bad, but you know, it just sucks not being able to use it at the beginning. Go shoot the dragon. He's dead. Go work on the golem now. But like I said, don't upgrade. You can upgrade the duration for plasma charges, but don't do anything with that. The damage, the bonus damage for it, because that's what makes it where your model cannon doesn't work. Like I said, it makes it take over that 500k mob on bosses. Okay, he's dead. catch up down here so I can get mod on. I was hoping the raven would be up there so I could get a leech from him. But yeah, he went down there. There's the boss. And now the boss is dead. But Battle Cruise is not hard to play. Once you learn how his moves work and you're on top of it, you can pretty much do any game mode with them. Having max prestige helps out a lot, but it's not a necessary thing. Let's see if we get paladins this time. Absolutely nothing. I really hate when we get nothing. And they got the boss that time. So I'll just go finish getting my boat. This one should be respawning any time. Keyboard should be. There he is. And there he goes. Where were you at, Bob? 
I'll see. There you are. Yeah, there he goes. I actually enjoy the Battle Cruiser too, just his mobility's so nice. But on this one and the weapon range, I'd leave last thing with the mount lasers, just the mount it costs is a scene. But my standard attack now is 15 lasers. So if I do that, I get 30 lasers. And if I streamline it, one target gets hit 30 times. So you can do the math. It's a nice little bit of damage. And yes, my bow cruiser looks different, same with his lasers. I have a custom skin on mine. And now bow cruiser is fully open. Go tempt fate again. I like it when we get paladins. Oh, now we get the minerals. That would have been nice at the beginning of the game. It's probably nice for the hybrid still, though. Hybrid's looking at. And you can turn that on auto cast. I want to say auto cast is still glitchy to where it auto casts before it runs out. It only gives you like a quarter of it. just blasting them with lasers. Well guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. I don't like them hitting 20 minute marks. To me that's a little long. But you guys should get the gist of it. If you guys get any questions about any of the heroes I do, feel free to DM me on Discord. I'll answer the fastest I can. Or even on you know YouTube. Feel free to comment. You guys have a great one. Stay safe. Remember, hit that like, subscribe button for me. You guys have a good one.